Well, ATC, you can see here behind me, traffic is close to all but one lane right now, and it's backed up. We're just past the Northgate Boulevard exit. It's backed up to about Truxel. And you can see over here, CHP officers tell us that what happened was a big rig driver fell asleep at the wheel. He hit this light pole over here, overcorrected, and, uh, and rolled over on the freeway. It was just a few minutes later that another car came along and struck that big rig. Amazingly, there were only minor injuries, but you can see uh, quite a big scene here on the interstate and traffic again backed up for quite a ways. We've got Sergeant Jeff Carlisle with the California Highway Patrol here. Uh, tell me right now, it looks like you've got another vehicle here. What are you doing with this overturned big rig? At this point, we have three lanes closed on Interstate 80 uh, here at Northgate, and we need to overturn or upright the big rig so that we can open up the lanes. And so our options are to either offload all the material, which could take several hours with the, with the help of Caltrans, or use what they're doing now is using these pneumatic airbags, which is stuff underneath the trailer, and they're going to inflate the airbags and hopefully lift up the trailer without uh, uh, any issues and be able to tow the uh, truck to trailer out, out of here. And have you been able to confirm, is this a full trailer? We don't know the exact uh, load of, the, of, the, of the, the trailer. The driver was transported to a local hospital with minor injuries, so we weren't able to, to uh, do a significant interview with him. Uh, but we have an idea of what's in the truck, but we're not positive, so we're being a bit cautious on how uh, we, we treat the trailer so that we don't end up breaking it or rupturing it and causing a bigger issue. Okay, and in the meantime, for drivers who are planning on heading in this direction this morning, any advice for them? Uh, there is a backup extending uh, a couple miles uh, west of this location. There is a bit of fog in the area that I've heard from other officers. So uh, if you're traveling eastbound 80 coming out of the Davis area into Sacramento, it might be better to use business 80 as an alternate route this morning. Okay, great. Thank you. And uh, we can confirm that on the way over here. We saw some fog uh, just up the street right around Truxell Avenue. So there is a bit of fog this morning. Again, this backup uh, goes right now to about Truxell as far as we can see. Uh, and traffic again down to one lane here on the interstate, as uh, the sergeant said, for probably the next couple of hours. It just all depends on how long it takes them to get this big rig upright and out of here. Reporting live along I-80, Kristen Samos, KCRA 3 News.